With me is our resident travel expert, Debbie Griffiths. Debbie, welcome. Thank you. You have got the best job, I think, in the world. We are all incredibly jealous of you. Tough job, but someone's got to do it. Uh, but you come with credentials. You have written for New Zealand Herald, Stuff.co.nz, Travel Digest magazine, and New Zealand Fitness. And, of course, you're a mum of two as well, which qualifies you for everything. We are just a week away from the school holidays, and I hear that you have done something a little bit different and a little bit out of character for you, isn't it? You, not you travelling, it was your daughter. Yeah, that's right. What's up with that? She got to go away, not me this time. But I do tend to be a real helicopter parent. I don't let them out of my sight too much. This, I was reassured by Air New Zealand, would be absolutely fine to send them away by themselves. So I sent my daughter on a trip away. Let's check it out. OK, so our mission is to send a 12-year-old on a plane by herself to the Hawke's Bay to spend a weekend with family friends without freaking out. I'm not freaking out. Okay, I'm freaking out. At check-in, children travelling unaccompanied on Air New Zealand now receive an airband as part of the service. The technology is a world first. So airband itself is embedded with technology that allows us to scan and let the parents know through text notifications at each stage of the journey. Okay, so I have my first text to look from Air New Zealand. Great, Asher has checked in, she's gone through. I have been asked to stay at the terminal just in case there's any delays, any cancellations, anything that my child might need me on hand for I'm here. So in the meantime, have a coffee. Asher's airband is scanned by staff at four stages during her journey and a text message update is sent to up to five nominated contacts. So not only am I feeling reassured and up to date, our family friend in Hawke's Bay is also in the loop. We had some fabulous feedback on airbands, uh, both from the children themselves who think the wristband's kind of cool and travelling alone for that matter, uh, but also for parents providing them with peace of mind. Asha is escorted to the gate by a staff member. In the air, she's placed in a seat where the crew can keep an eye on her. She even gets a bit of special attention. The flight attendant, Hermali's been really nice to me and she said I'll be able to hand out lollies later. Check out the view. <laughs> At the other end, Asha is once again taken under the wing of staff members to guide her through the airport and into the waiting arms of our family friend. Just like I did at the drop-off earlier, Fiona needs to provide photo ID to be able to pick up Asha. We actually look after the tens of thousands of children each year. There is an additional small cost for using the airband service. But the added peace of mind for a nervous parent, priceless. No way. That is great. So that's what you've got on today. Yeah, so I've got it on today. It's just a really lightweight, bit of a stretchy, flexy band there. And they, yeah, scanned it at each part of the journey. And I knew exactly what was going on the whole time. Really reassuring. Amazing. Really, She had a great time. So how they can't get it off and like put it on some other child's wrist uh, mid-air? Because that would be bad. It would be really bad. No, uh, she really loved wearing it and she's kept it as a lovely souvenir as well. Now, if you're going on a domestic flight, it'll cost you about it cost you $15 for a one-way trip. If you're going on an overseas international flight, it'll cost you $40. So really great peace of mind for the parents. That really is. And when they say they scan it four times throughout the trip, so they're scanning it in the air as well? They're scanning it when she gets to the other end of the journey and they're scanning it at the gate so she's... So she's, she goes with someone through the airport. That's great. So you really can say, see you, darling. Bye. Woo, through the gate. And have Literally peace of mind. gone. Yeah, and she was fine. That is wonderful. Thank you, Debbie. Thank you for making Asher a guinea pig for us. <laughs> really interesting to see. And we look forward to more travel reports next Wednesday as well.